Hey YouTube, Dutch Sense here. It is 3.21 a.m. Central Standard Time on Thursday, May 12th, 2011. And yes, we are here looking at Sean Connery in the old movie Zardos. And you may have never heard of Zardos, but Sean Connery indeed played this role of a futuristic mutant in a radiation-afflicted society in the future where he plays a hunter who kills other mutants who are running around the wastelands. And he works for these rich people, these elites that live in their little bubble. And they stay away from the radiation and keep themselves pure. Zardos. Now why am I showing this to you? You're probably asking yourself right now. Well, first I've got to show you something else, and that's the NILU. The NILU is a place that I've been bringing you forecasts from um, for Fukushima. Now if you go over to the NILU now, here it is. Here we go. Thank you for your interest in the FlexPart products for Fukushima. The forecast system is no longer running. You can't see anything. They took it all down. Or did they? Look at the address up here, guys. HTTP slash slash Zardos dot N-I-L-U dot N-O. Now why would they call it Zardos? Well, Zardos is the post-apocalyptic nuclear future, isn't it? Right? Well, let's take a look. Let's see what's on the Zardos server. Let's find out what the post-apocalyptic future looks like. Here you go. Look at the purple. Now let's just, that's not just an anomaly, guys. This is the real forecast. Store, look how many of these there are. Okay, there's a lot. So let's go through, I've saved all of these already. So it's not like they can take them down. Um, every other one is basically blank. Maybe not every other one, but um, all the ones with low kilobytes are blank. Now the ones with high kilobyte count are the ones that we need to look at. Now you're not going to believe it. Okay, there's the one we just looked at a second ago. This is Xenon 133 all the way at the top. And then it, as you get to South America, it gets um, less. But let's look at a few more. Here's Cesium 137. Look at Alaska, guys. Look at the United States. Cesium-137, and look at the dates. Forecast for 511, 512. There's more. Oh, wait. Just wait till you see. I hate to be the bearer of bad news, folks. I really do. I don't like having to bring this out to you. Iodine-131, coming over the continental United States as of 512. Look at Alaska. This is iodine-131. Okay. Let's just keep going. Um, that's the one we just looked at, sorry. And be prepared, it's running slow to begin with, and the more people that get on here, the more it's going to run slow. Iodine-131, Northern Hemisphere. Okay, let's just carry on. This is over in Europe for iodine-131, and it looks like low end, that's good. I'll tell you what, it's a little disconcerting to see this. Okay, here we go, xenon-133, look at this guys. And look at the date. Z 
Xenon 133. Truly amazing. The link for all these are down below. And again, Prophetic Seer is going to mirror this on his live link site, which will be a link down below. And I'm going to get a hold of Mike from Patriotic Space, and he will be mirroring this as well. And for the time being, I've got it all backed up. And we've already sent it out to several other people, so it's not like they can get rid of this. They can't block it out like they did the last time. Um, this time we've got it. We've got all of them. There's hundreds of them. And they appear to be fairly accurate in their projection. I just don't know exactly what we're looking at other than a lot of radiation. And this is just kind of bad. Honestly, I don't know what to think of this. So, there you have it, folks. This is breaking news. Unfortunately, it's breaking bad news. But... I just don't know what else to say other than here's cesium-137 coming aboard the west coast. Right up north of British Columbia. Heavy levels. Extremely heavy. Cesium-137, Pacific Northwest. This needs to take right to the top. This needs to get out. That's it. There's no doubt about it, guys. All these links need to be viewed in public by everyone. Zardos of all things, man.